Tomorrow's Halloween and I just wanted to do um, a rust in peace um, version of you know in, in regards to like the Halloween theme um, I'm, it's titled rust in peace because I'm doing this video in uh, in my ex-husband's man cave and in regards to my ex-husband and I um, I will address a, a question uh, that was asked in regards to like I was asked a question in regards to my wedding ring, you know, and, and all that. And my ex-husband and I, we don't have, um, you know, the the average relationship. It's an interesting setup, but I will share that in another vlog. Today's vlog is going to uh, really concentrate on the Halloween, Halloween theme. And I wanted to tell the story about this experience that uh, I had with, with my daughters when they were babies and uh, three-year-olds. So back in 1992, I had my my oldest daughter, and she was three at that time. And I had just recently gave birth to my second daughter. And uh, we had gone down to my mom's to just visit and hang out. I had my two girls with me. And um, so my three-year-old daughter was playing in the bedroom, and I was out in the living room, which was just a few steps away from the bedroom my three-year-old daughter was playing in. I was out in the living room with my newborn, my second daughter, uh, me, my newborn, and my mom. We were sitting on the couch, just, you know, just hanging out. And then uh, all of a sudden, like, we heard this, hi, Sissy. All of a sudden, all of a sudden, we heard this loud, crashing noise, loud. I cannot emphasize loud. It was loud. It sounded like someone had taken a bat it sounded like someone had taken a baseball bat and hit like a a large mirror that's what it sounded like that that's how loud that sound was and that's that's the scale of what the sound sounded like like had to, it sounded like someone had taken a large bat and had hit not a tiny compact mirror like a large dresser mirror and my mom had a dresser a mirror dresser in her bedroom and that sound, that sound came from the bedroom that my three-year-old daughter was playing in. We were like startled out of, off of the couch, my mom and I, and we ran into the bedroom and I was expecting to see my mom's dresser mirror just like in, in you know, in pieces and my daughter like extremely like hurt. I was, I was just so scared. But guess what I found, my three-year-old, my three-year-old was sitting on my mom's bed and she she just simply like looked at me and she said mommy look my bracelet she was like mommy look my bracelet and she's a three-year-old and what happens in in our culture um specifically like with chamorro women is when they have girls of course at it you know newborn and uh you know just uh from birth a month or less so tomorrow women what we do with our our daughters are are if we you know if we have a daughter at birth we pierce their ears and then we definitely give them a bamboo bracelet gold and everything is like pure gold like the jewelry we give our daughters is pure gold and my daughter had on and specifically it's these bamboo bracelets which are really really hard to find in real gold so what happened was my three-year-old daughter was holding up her gold bamboo bracelet but it was broken in half it was broken in half and it was no longer yellow gold it was silver like white gold her her gold bracelet 
pure gold bracelet had cracked in half and it had turned into white gold. And she was just holding up the two pieces. She goes, Mom, there was nothing array or, or broken or damaged in the room. The dresser, the mirror was all in one piece. There was nothing broken in that room other than her gold bracelet that had, like I said, broken in half and turned in color from yellow gold to white gold. And this is a three-year-old and, and this happened, there was a loud, extremely loud noise, like a someone taking a bat to a large mirror. My mom, she, she said just one word, and I was like, mom, what is that? Because the way she said that word, I mean, she was just, my mom was, I, she was also like in disbelief. It, we, we couldn't explain how a pure gold bracelet turned white gold, broke in half, and was, was um, you know, uh, it, it, which followed a very loud sound. I asked my mom, mom, what does that word mean, inairi? And she said, it's it's like if some something bad was supposed to happen and it's to, to an individual and instead it, it happens to something materialistic around them. But it's, it is, I can't, it's a true story. It, it's true, it happened. I just, I can't explain it. I, I, if anyone has ever experienced that, please, you know, comment below. In our culture, we hear of people just like just holding a plate, like a uh, porcelain plate, and just it just like cracks out of nowhere. But I have never heard uh, what we experienced, me and my daughters and my mom, experienced. And one more time, I'm gonna say it was a pure gold bamboo bracelet uh, that you know broke in half and turned into white gold, and um, followed you know sorry there's planes flying overhead so um but it, it's a true story and um and um I, I remember when my daughter held up her bracelet i was like that's not your bracelet where's your bracelet because i didn't recognize it because it was gold yellow gold and what she was handing me was white gold like silver it was like sterling silver but you know it, it was white gold and i was like where's your bracelet she goes that's my bracelet mommy i was like so that's my that's my rust in peace story true really honestly a true story so today i am wearing those levi's jeans that i got from ross a while ago this one shoulder shirt top that i got from amazon my bottega inspired earrings that i also got from amazon i'm just wearing my uh, brown strap sandals from target solid ring and this is a solid ring. Now Abracadabra Time for the second ring. Oh <clears throat> 